Lee hired a tech expert, Dr. Kalugin, to study the algorithms used in both software. According to his study, the source codes of both the programs shared similarities, and thus there was a direct cause of patent infringement. However, the non-technical jury failed to understand a word Kalugin uttered, and therefore his analysis didn't amount to anything substantial. The verdict of the case relied on Brian Anderson's testimony. At first, Brian denied remembering Jury and Carson and their meetings in Silicon Valley and Berlin. He even refused to accept that he had ever told Jury that Terravision inspired his software. As Brian turned down the truth, the jury went with the flow and decided against Jury and Carson. The judge announced the verdict, in which the jury rejected all the acquisitions and claims made by Ant plus Kong. The tech giant was discharged from the charges and Jury and Carson returned to Berlin with nothing. At the end of the billion dollar code, Jury and Carson didn't get the fame and money for their invention that they deserved, but they did get one thing, each other. The Terravision lawsuit brought the friends back together. Jury decided to move to Berlin and work with Carson again. He already had an idea for a secure messaging service with encrypted HTTPS access, signal, and would probably work on that. The inventors will begin again, again from scratch, to revolutionize the world. They may not have become rich or famous or turned into world leaders, but they changed the way we see the world. And that's their story that no one can ever steal from them. One can steal an artist's artwork, but he or she cannot steal the artistry.